Hey sixth graders, we're back and we're going to talk about geometric solids today and we're going to talk about some of their attributes, some of their characteristics, okay? So let's get started. Okay, I have a few geometric solids here and I just used them off of a worksheet, okay? And we can see this one is a rectangular prism because we have a rectangle, okay? And it's 3D, so that tells us it's prism, okay? Here we have a pyramid and we could tell it's a pyramid because it has triangles on the sides and a square base. Here's a cube because it has squares on each side. Okay, so these are the only three I'm going to talk about today and we can see that when they are 3D they have a length, they have a width, and they have a height. They have three different measures on them. Okay, a length, a width, and this one has a height that would go right up the middle. It would be one of those where they draw that dotted line with the, bo with the um, right angle. Same thing here, length, width, and height. Okay? So some of the characteristics of these shapes are that they have faces. Okay? A face is the flat part on each side. Those are the faces of the shape. So this is faces, this triangle. Each of these triangles is a face and a square. Okay, and then this has faces, okay? They also have edges, and as you'd imagine, the edges are these lines on the sides, okay? They have edges, all right? So if a question asks you how many edges, you could count how many lines it would have. Make sure you count the ones you can't see, because we know that there's a couple back here, like three of them, that we can't see in this picture, okay? And then they have vertices or vertex. And that is the corner. A vertex is one corner. If, you're, if they ask how many vertices, they're asking how many corners. Okay, so faces are the flats. Edges are the sides. These lines on the side where they meet, where they bend. And then the vertices or vertex are the corners, the points. Okay? All right. So remember, these three solids that we talked about today, we have rectangular prism because it has a rectangular side, okay? A pyramid has triangles, face, and a cube has squares on each face, okay? And our characteristics were faces, the flats, edges, the, le the length of the bends, and vertic verte vertexes or vertices, which are the corners. All right. Great job today, sixth graders. We'll see you tomorrow.